I'm Josh Anderson, manager of the service parts and attachments business at the John Deere Des Moines Works. One topic lately that has received a lot of attention from our dealers is the topic of spray boom enhancements. As we look at the amount of used equipment on dealer lots and the age of those machines, as well as the need for our customers to have an extremely relevant machine to help them with the challenge of herbicide resistance, we've got a few things we want to take a look at together. So let's take a look at first poly plumbing that we see on many of our legacy John Deere machines, machines that have had a number of years of service. And we can see over time, this poly plumbing does begin to fatigue. You see the warping occurring here. And now, not only is that a cosmetic and visual concern that will definitely affect the value of that machine, we also know that does disrupt and compromise the spray pattern. So we have inconsistencies in the height as well as the angles that we're spraying. And we know we need to be making our best effort every time that sprayer makes a pass through the field to help our customers be successful with that challenge of herbicide resistance. So we're pleased to show you today the Express Boom Assembly. This is a very simple way for a customer to make an upgrade from that fatigued poly plumbing to the more professional grade John Deere stainless steel plumbing. This comes equipped with a high flow nozzle body, which is a nice upgrade from the standard flow they would have had on the poly plumbing. And it also comes equipped, already installed and tested, just to make sure there's no leaks and it's ready to go, the Express end cap. Now this is an upgrade that can be made on any of our John Deere machines that don't have the new end cap aspirators that you'll find on the 4 Series sprayers. This is a really nice upgrade to that machine. If you contrast that with the poly plumbing over here, you can see this dead zone. And so after that last nozzle body on that spray pipe, you can have that denzo, dead zone that will very easily build up contamination of chemical and make it difficult to clean out. So this is definitely the professional way to go. We want to have all the features and benefits that we offer on our new sprayers, very similar that you can make those upgrades. So as our customers are looking at ways to add value to those machines, dealers are looking for ways to help improve resale value of those machines. Also very simple ways to change spacing from 15 to 20 inch or from 20 inch to 15 inch. We've got a lot, a lot of great enhancements here. And these are definitely ways we can work with our customers to make those sprayers relevant in this battle of herbicide resistance and increase the value of the resale.